Hollywood value black British actors over the American actors that are African American? Um, I was wondering that because in the new movie, Harriet Tubman, she is actually played by a British actress. Her name is Cynthia Erivo, an executive wanting Julia Roberts to play Harriet Tubman. He, his excuse was that it was so long ago, nobody would remember, but it's the weirdest thing to have a white redheaded actress such as Julia Roberts, who's a great actress, um, even be considered or thought of. I mean, it's, it's like very Rachel Dolezal in terms of just the identification. <laughs> I mean, can she play it? Um, maybe it's the story, but it represents more being that she was a black woman that led slaves to freedom. Um, having a white actress play her, it would only be a fascination with the hero, the hero story, which is a woman who led a lot of slaves to freedom, but it would have been culturally inappropriate for this type of situation going on. However, executives in Hollywood do have the power, but it got me to thinking, do they value British actors that are black over African-American actors um, because these are predominantly African-American roles. Roles, you have Idris Elba. Uh, he's a, a huge Hollywood star uh, who started off on The Wire. He's been in a lot of movies, some of them primarily African-American roles um, that he played and he played well. But then you have Chewy Tell Ejiofor. I'm not saying his name correct. I'll try it again. And then we have Chewy Tell. Then we have Chewy and Tell Ejiofor. Ejiofor. <laughs> then we have Chewy and Tell Ejiofor. Ejiofor. Whatever. Okay. Chewy and Tell Ejiofor. Chewy and Tell Ejiofor. Okay. He is. <laughs> <laughs> An actor that garnered attention playing 12 Years a Slave. You have Damson Idris, who's the star of Snowfall, uh, playing an American drug dealer in the 1980s. You have a lot of black actors getting roles. Uh, Fear of the Walking Dead or The Walking Dead, the guy that plays Morgan, he is British. And I wonder what is the requirement over American, African-American actors. I know there's a lot of African-American actors, some out of work, some are working, but is there a thought of Hollywood believing that the black British actors are better for American, African-American roles? I mean, that's what you think of when you see these movies and a role like Harriet Tubman really brought it to my attention because what was the requirement for this British woman? We all have a black experience, but there's a different black experience in Europe than it is in America. We have actors that are paid to be other people and believable characters is done all the time. That's what acting's all about. But the casting and the requirements to perform those things, it takes a connection if you really want to be believable. You might have a brilliant British actor, but that doesn't mean that they could capture uh, an American hero tale who auditioned. What are the casting choices and the acting choices that the actors made in the audition process to even get cast for the role? Um, I wonder what is going on it's not a bad thing. Lena Waite, the writer of the show, The Shy on Showtime, said that casting of British actors versus American actors, um, the mention of that is divisive. Um, I think it's divisive as well at times, but then I think about, I wonder how many American actors um, auditioned for those roles. I mean, what did they do? 
to not get the role? What did they not do? Is it something that the casting directors had a preference for? I mean, I like to hear black uh, people from Europe speak. It's fascinating to me. If you're from Australia, you're black, or if you're from the UK and you're black, and hear that that dialect come out of them, it's 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 fun to see. But we're not talking about a character that is speaking or telling a British um, led story. It's it's uh, a character that's from the UK. However, they are speaking with maybe a slang from the south side of Chicago or they're speaking with terminology that's from Compton, California, or they're playing an intellectual with a uh, proper accent. Um, a lot of times you don't know that they're British until they start speaking. But I just wonder what is the requirement or are they favored in Hollywood? Are British actors that are African-American favored in Hollywood over African-American actors? Um, and we're not even talking about colorism, shade, preference or anything like that. We're taking we're talking about pure talent, pure acting skills and pure understanding and connection to the role um, just because you're a British actor black actor doesn't mean that you can't get connection. You can't do your research. It doesn't mean that you can't pull out an amazing performance in a movie or a TV show. Um, but I wonder, is the connection stronger if I'm African-American actor in Hollywood and I go out for a role that I researched as well, that I actually did um, character evaluation, analyzing a character that I wanted to play and I wanted to express my views on. If I could convey it better than a British actor that doesn't know the soil, that didn't have that much of a connection, I wonder, will I get picked over a British actor? Does Hollywood think, and this really is about what Hollywood thinks when they're casting, when they're making these choices, um, especially these films that are, are not always um, having uh, African Americans behind the scenes. Um, it it makes it hard to distinguish the authenticity of something when everything seems to be kind of watered down. Um, a British actor is considered to have more education, they're more prestigious, um, it's just the way it is. I think that a lot of British actors have, they come off with a polish or maybe it could be an arrogance, but it's something about them that makes them seem like they think they're superior, but they, they might not be. They might be the most down to earth people in the world. And I'm just generalizing no one in particular, but I have um, thought about this and I wonder what you think about it. Follow my social media handles. My name is Darrell. Go to my website, scareofthelight.com. Please share and subscribe so you can be a part of the contest, the cash apps, everything that we have involved. Um, let me know what you think about Julia Roberts being cast in a role of Harriet Tubman. What do you think about Julia Roberts and the thought of her playing Harriet Tubman by a Hollywood exec. So what do you think? Does Hollywood prefer the black British actor over the American actor? I have a book coming out called The Brown Paper Bag Boys and the Colorism Experiment. And I also have another book called Scare of the Light. Go to scareofthelight.com and you'll be able to see the progress of what's coming ahead. You let me know what you think. I'll talk to you later in the next video. Peace.